And now we have an update to a story we first brought you last Thursday when video caught a thief riding off with a 13 year old's lawnmower and lawn cutting equipment in Leavenworth. The thief put the young man's business and hobby on hold. It's been kind of weird because I usually mow about once every day. It's a very big hobby of mine and I really enjoy it. But now the community is once again stepping up. KSHB 41 News reporter Nick Starling caught up with the family. Sitting on the steps outside their house, Leland Williams and his mom, Brittany, are in better spirits today. People are a lot less angry now. So as of right now, someone has donated a weed eater, blower, and gas can. And there might be a local company who will donate a mower, so that way Leland can continue his passion. I honestly like to give a big thanks to them, how nice they've been to me and what they've done. The donors didn't want to go on camera, but checking out the GoFundMe page, more than $2,500 have poured in. I can't even even say thank you enough. Just the fact that people are so willing to help just means so much. For the new lawnmower, we're going to buy a trailer with that to help keep it a little bit more safe. This is the second time the community stepped up for this family after Leland had his left leg amputated when he was involved in a mowing accident last year. They paid for the orange mower seen here that a thief rode off in last Tuesday. Oh, it's amazing seeing the community come together once again, you know, after they they helped out with my last things after when I was ran over. This time around, the family is being extra cautious, so something like this never happens again. There won't be anything left in our uh, our front yard, our driveway, anything like that again. I hate the fact that I now feel uncomfortable. Once Leland gets his mower, the first thing he'll do, you guessed it, cut grass and pay it forward. I'll probably go mow a couple lawns for free. Reporting in Leavenworth, Nick Starling, KSHB 41 News.